Hello everyone, this is a Johnny Aztec Media tutorial on a more advanced kind of text intro. Yeah, I know we've done three videos on text, but after this we're going to get into the editing and things. So, for this we're going to we're going to have some clouds going over the top, we have some little bolts of electricity and some audio. So, uh, if you look to the view box again, then you'll see what we're going to end up with. I don't know if you can hear the audio, but... Now the lag is because of the uh, screen recorder, but yeah. Okay, so firstly what we're going to want to do is we are going to want to bring in an audio track and insert text media. For this again, I'm going to use the good old YouTube. Place in the middle, properties, yep, yep. Oh, my audio box isn't showing up. Yeah, view. Where the hell is it? Video preview. There we go. Sorry about that, everyone. Uh, fuck's sake. Anyway, yep. Yeah, there we go. So we've just got our plain text. Not really doing anything. Is standing there. So now we're going to want our background. So to media generators, then where the oh, it's gone gay. What we're going to do is try and get like a, a nice backgroundy kind of effect. It's not going to be an actual background. It's going to be like a a mist effect, which is over it to make it look kind of like mysterious. As you can see in the video, you see the little misty bit there, which is what we're going to try and effect, use. We also can use our other skills of using the um, pan and crop to. Ah, oh, there, nope. There we go. The noise textures, then you see this cloud cover. That doesn't look like much, but then when you drag it down pop up then we're going to want to do the good old oops drag it to the very end then put its progress in degrees right up to the very top this point in time is behind it we are going to want it to go the other side of it so it's like over the top god my PC's weird today As you can see, it's going over the top of it now. We're now going to want to use the pan and crop tool. Right then, um, we're going to use the good old twizzle to go to about there. Then we're going to zoom in and twirl again. Then zoom out. Bring it to there. We're going to spin. All the way around this time. Just out the Sorry about that. We really should tell people not to come when I'm recording. Just going to spin around this way. And then we're going to zoom all the way out. And spin around again. Then for the finale, oops, it's going to go all the way forward. There we go. So you can't see it. Right. So now, if we look, have our effect. Yeah, it's a bit laggy, but that's because of the clip. Now, as you saw, we had electricity. So move the YouTube down one, drag and drop the lightning effect in. Let's close that for a second or two so we can get all the clips lined up. There we go. That's retarded, sorry. Um, long way round. 
Yeah, yeah. Alright then, we're going to want our progression degrees obviously first. And now what you can do is offset it so a place where you want it to be. I'm going to have it about there, I think. Hmm. Anyway, yeah. As you saw, we kind of had like a, a an effect around it. For this one, we go to color gradient. We now have to drag them all down. I know I wish on this first, but you know. And then we choose the uh, epileptic transparent to black. This will give us a nice effect around it. So do that. There we go. As you can see there, we now have a slightly thing around it. Play it. Obviously, you can mess about, do whatever you want. But yeah, that was a Johnny Aztec Media tutorial. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. And rate and subscribe there'll be more videos not on intros but we like more on the how to make it look nicer and cinematic effects and anything like that so thank you for watching and see you again